At yeah. least in uh the fr at least in like off off the reset. Mm -hmm. And then Utah figured it out and turned it back. There you go. Or whoops. And so Skynard switched back. Yep. And hit safe. There we go. Alright. Grand finals. Utah's gotta get six Utah's gotta get six. Skynard only has to get three. This will be interesting. Yep. We may see another uh, Game 10 situation. Uh, we had that last week. It was rough. <laughs> Man. Oh, yeah. nice. Skyner's being really careful about a lot of the projectiles coming in at this point. Oh, oh. Wait, too high, I guess. Yeah. Too high, it's a little too far forward. Oh, nice. The 8Y uh, uh, gives him the invulnerability for that. Ooh. Air counter to counter to combo to, uh, <laughs> damaging combo because exactly. hey you get so, a counter let you got a counter let's give you a nice combo off of that there you go it's a counter contest here normally I mean they both actually no none of them got this is why he doesn't have air counter just mainly guard of war this yeah. kind of gives him a bit more of an advantage but it's a pretty slow attack from the air so. Right. Him with the Umbreon, yep. but I think Utah pressed the button. Oh, no. Nope. Alright, he gets it. Activates his burst just to respond. Nice little the, bait on the Psychic. The Future Sight just uh, saved him. Oh, ooh. ooh. Got, the, uh, yeah. got the yeah. uh, heavy armor in him. Thanks to Surgy Bursting, and that's uh, round one right there for Utah. Now, Utah's actually playing pretty solidly here. He's uh, utilizing a lot of in and out baits to get Skyner to throw out attacks and then punish those attacks afterwards. Skyner just going left and right, find that motion. Now just getting through all the counters and the frenzy plant. Get him in the air, unfortunately, that's a back roll, not a plant. Finally catching something with the anti-air. Oh, I guess he really doesn't like dual phase with uh... It is Utah, who is uh, far more aggressive than most uh, Gardevoirs. Yeah, pretty much. Um, really, what that did there, uh, why it was a really good option, is it shifted the momentum. Uh, Utah was on the on the aggression there, Ouch. and instead, what it did was shift the momentum away from mm. Utah having the aggression back to mm. neutral, in which Skyner won in field phase and was able to finish the round out because of it. That makes sense. I mean, if you don't feel very comfortable about a certain phase, Double B is your answer most of the time. When it comes to certain matchups. Moonblast matchup not doing anything against that combo. Nope. Get him in the air a bit too early. Nice, nice response with the counter. Throwing in future sights. Nice! Nice. Nice throw. U utilizing, utilizing Psychic there to get the force mix up. There you go. But... Interesting right. trade. That's not gonna connect, but no. we'll do some chip at least. Decidueye's yep. one of those, is one of those bursts where chip is pretty high, and I guess that mostly goes to the same with any projectile burst. Yep. Nice wow, the all out again there. Uh, I'm telling you, air counters are pretty much your best friend against Decidueye most of the time. Yep. Oh, but this combo is gonna do some pretty decent damage here and knock him out of burst. Yeah. Looks like he might have been trying to go for a uh, nice, nice CAC first forward attack. just to uh, make sure that air grab doesn't connect. Yep. Switching the phase again. Skyner is just on the approach nowadays. Ah, reads ah. the counter, and that's gonna do it. Game Let's see. one, two. Skyner. And see, that's why our Celebi's so good because of the phase shift there. It put it shifted momentum once again from Utah to Skyner. Skyner. Um, Utilizing the knockdown, basically, that Selby provides. Um, got in there and won the mix-up. There you go. Alright, are we going to see support? Are we going to be seeing a support switch from Utah? Because I, mean, I say Rotom is a good idea in this occasion, but... Um, Umbreon was working pretty well. For yeah, Umbreon works as well as as good, but... It, it's, kind of a diff it's kind of a choice whether you want pressure or you just want to catch him. Like, what is what? this? Did he just... Magneton. Interesting. I guess I can see why Magneton, he would choose though. that, actually. Magneton would 
definitely, if you can get the timing right, mm -hmm. uh, heavily... Can uh, Decidueye's, like, extra... What? Sort of extra hop or something like that? Wait, what happened? Did he switch he to... He went uh, to Quagsire. Quagsire? Quagsire, interesting. I think his idea with it is to create a safe spot for him to be able to stay back. Fair enough. Um, and it forces Skynard to either wait or come in via the air. And so, either way is advantageous for Utah. Okay, I can I can see that. There you go. You just sight going with the pressure. Good. That pressure is just bringing him down to below about. Oh. Those about the six left. At the rate Utah's going, he's not even going to get quick start for the oh geez. rounds down. Nice response by Utah. Mew coming in gets the crit. So and gets the, Ooh. gets the response. That's gonna be a huge damage with the wall splat. That's yeah. gonna real. That's gonna cost. Him. Oh, he he tried to move, thinking it was gonna be a charge at this point. First, come come all out, Magnemite. All in all, Magnemite two front and center. Yep, now he's the burst. <laughs> uh, Unfortunately, burst that's not gonna go yeah. in, but that will almost. I think that finally was... Nope. Nope, no, never mind. He was a bit too far away from that. Uh, he, not just too, too far, but he was also a little too early. Ah, uh, that's gonna do it on this round. Yeah. He was a little he was a little too late on that with that too because yeah. he was stuck in the burst anime, the mm -hmm. burst activation frames. Yeah. Um, so he wasn't able to actually get the attack out in time to punish. Mm -hmm. Oh. I think that uh. Oh. That nice. Actually worked. Interesting. Yeah. It was kind of scary because he actually air countered there too. So I know that uh, Utah does have a magneton combo that he used to try out pretty frequently. Ooh, switching the phase, going back to where he's comfortable with. There you go. Yes. Could he? Nope. Okay. Honestly, he could have instead of like attacking Garvel while on the wall, he could have done the magneton just for the debuff, but. But I guess he just wanted it to just confirm, or maybe there some doubt. Go. Oh, there, we go. there you go. That's what he was waiting for. Uh, yeah, that makes sense. I think he just I, Yeah, he button. countered, he countered. Yep. yep. <laughs> and That's so good. Skyner takes game two. One more and Skyner takes it all. I'm not sure uh, messing with Utah before his game was a <laughs> good idea. <laughs> I don't think that's what's bothering him right now. He just... He has a hard time with birds in general. Yeah. Bird is... Like, honestly, when you're doing a bird, it's kind of like dancing most of the time. Where, like, you, know, you gotta follow him where he's at, where he's kind of vulnerable. And that's just usually where the air counters kind of come in nowadays. Where Gardevoir can easily just interrupt with one of his air moves. Unless the grab comes in, which unfortunately, the, unfortunately, depending on the timing, the uh, you can air grab the air counter, but it's a lot of timing at this point. But oh jeez, do you toss a bait right now on the crest or the maybe the Mew as well? Maybe he, he is. Could... He does like his Mew. Uh, I don't blame I him on that. Wouldn't be surprised if he went. Yep. Yeah, I figured Rotom. he would go with Rotom because yeah. he may need the pressure just to keep. Because when Decidue is in the air, Utah is kind of vulnerable. Utah is kind of, uh... That's where the situation gets all his 50-50s. Basically. And most of those 50-50s don't go into Utah's favor most of the time in this type of set at this point, so... I guess we're just gonna be seeing a bit more of an approach. Where he's just gonna be mo fo more focusing on pressure than just catching. Ah, uh, once let again, go, he let... let, let yeah. I love the, the music player. for this stage. Ah, <laughs> uh, Dark Coliseum is one of those good ones. Look at that damage. Oh, nice response. There you go. There we go, he's got a nice counter going. Oh, Ooh. future sight. That is actually psychic. That's psychic. Psych oh, psychic interrupt that? Yeah, psychic, oh, wow. psychic's the slow orb that does the power. Oh, I, I thought that was future sight. No, future sight's the invisible trap. Ooh. Oh, okay. Skarner picking up uh, momentum once again. There you go. Oh, oh, releasing it too early, unfortunately. Forced to use his burst pretty uh Rotom, gonna keep him on the ground for a bit, where he's vulnerable. Activating the burst, Rotom is still in, he can still jump. Oh! Is that right, I think he's... 
No, Rotom is gone. Rotom is gone. Alright. Ooh. Oh, the sucker, sucker punch. punch! Finally, we see that one. Skynard, very good option there. Calling out Utah's habit to uh, immediately anti-air. One more on Skynard's side. He takes the he takes the tournament. That oh, was a interesting little pew pew feather move. All right, yeah. Gonna take it. Gonna make sure he does not use that Rotom. And uh, scream. Yep. Yeah. Yep. There you go. Get the screech in there. Keep that debuff on for a little longer. There you go. Seeing a little bit more zoning for once. There you go. Maybe he should realize oh, that he's Oh, no. And he's gonna get caught. It doesn't do damage, but no. Sh phase shift. You can actually, uh, oh no. That's, that easy that's gonna hurt. Yeah. I think if you're back far enough, you can actually, uh, avoid the Celebi. You can also grab it if you're up close. Oh, interesting. Oh. oh. Still can't use support. Looking for it, though. Oh no. Um, I couldn't tell what he did. He shield. Alright. Nice, oh, nice. 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 Alright, there's still hope. There's still hope. Thank you. Oh my gosh. Oh, it's your birthday today? Tomorrow. Oh, oh actually, tomorrow. It is today. It is today. Oh, it is today. But with just like uh, that, Skyner. Um, Skyner taking it 3 0 over Utah. Yeah. Alright, I'm gonna go give Utah yeah. a hug because he probably needs it.